This woman suffered with Senzo when she had nothing. She was there in the most difficult times of his career when he had nothing and no woman could ever look at him. She was there when the parents were also suffering and of course she stood by him, supported him and made it to the point where Senzo was valued at approximately 375,000 euros in the market at that time. Yes guys, this woman did suffer indeed. For all that suffering, one woman came and tried to take away Senzo from her. That woman is Kelly Kumalo. Yes, Kelly Kumalo wanted Senzo Meiwa to divorce her wife and come marry her. Can you imagine that? In today's video, we'll be discussing about everything you need to know about this woman, the truth about her life with Senzo, how she did suffer, and of course, why she didn't actually like Kelly Kumalo after all. If you're new to this channel, if I tell you're passing by for the first time here, you're most definitely welcome to Afro Black Gossip. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel, give this video a like, leave a comment on the comment section. Thank you for your love and support. I definitely appreciate it. Mandisa Meiwa is a South African woman best known as the wife of Senzo Meiwa, the late Orlando Pirate and Bafana Bafana Goli. South African Goli Senzo Meiwa's life was taken away in 2014, what was suspected to be a robbery case. Since then, his wife Mandisa Meiwa has kept making it in and out of the news for a whole number of reasons. From speaking about the tragic events preceding the loss of her husband, she actually broke down into tears. To the betrayal she suffered, her narration in the book published about her husband by Soweto Manlazi, decoding 66 underscore nine, the inexplicable life of Senzo Meiwa and much more. She was married to South African Goli and of course they were married just for a few years before trouble crept in. Overwhelmed their home with accusations and cheating against Senzo, before the marriage approached its end, the subsequent passing on of the star Goli, the two were blessed with a daughter. Her real name goes by Mandisa and Kaiser and she was born on September 1986 in South Africa. Although the actual date of her birth has not yet been revealed, it is known that she was born and raised in South Africa. She got her education from Buffalo in Pilo Private School in Johannesburg and after she graduated, Mamdisa moved on to reach Park College. Next, she went to Durban Institute of Technology from where she got a human resource diploma and then a degree in business administration in 2008. Well, when Senzo and Mandisa and Kaiser met in 2005, he was still a young man who was trying to find his way out. How they met in Johannesburg is not known. But they remained together until 2011 when they finally got married. Their union was only traditionally done without making it further. 1st of October was the day it was supposed to be the anniversary. Although at first it seems like everything was a great marriage, Mandisa soon found out not long ago into their marriage that Senzo Meiwa was cheating on her with another woman who happened to be singer Kelly Kumalo. She would later reveal that she held nothing against the singer because she truly believed Kelly truly loved the late Koli. Marriage produced a daughter, Namla Meiwa, better known as Nana. She was six when her father passed away in 2014. Before then, Senzo was said to have another child with previous relationship that was known to the family and then he also had a child with Kelly Kumalo. When Mandisa found out about her husband cheating, he left her distraught. Even though he had already, she had already known that he was a Casanova, who was always cheating on her. It was revealed that he once went as far as sleeping with her best friend. This betrayal forced her to actually go depressed for a long time. She was altered by a friend that her husband was having an affair with pop singer Kelly Kumalo who plastered their pictures together on Instagram stories. The singer claimed that she didn't know that the footballer was married until five months after they started dating. Senzo also admitted that he never told her he was a married man. Mandisa left her matrimonial home following the incident and from then on her husband spent most of the time with his newfound love, 